All right, let's get started with this full body boxing workout. Get up, get loose. We're gonna start with our neck. We're gonna look up, stretching that neck, breathing deep. Look down, look up, down, up, down, up, and down. Good. Now we're gonna look to the left and to the right. Really feel that stretch, left, right, left, right. Make sure you're doing this at your own pace. You don't have to follow my pace. Left and right. Good, now half circles. Let's go one direction and then the next. Try to give it at least four times around. Starting to stretch out that neck. Alternating sides. Make sure you're breathing. Knees are slightly bent. All right, we're going to do arm swings. So for each of these, twice around is one rep, and we're going to do 10 reps. We're going to start with the right arm going forward. There's two, three, four, keep the shoulder loose, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. And you can take these slow to really feel that stretch. We're going to start left going forward. Two, three, four. Try to do this ten times. And like I said, go at your own pace. It's okay to go slow and really feel that stretch. You want to warm up the body. Start to get the heart rate up. I already start practicing that breathing. All right, we're going to do right arm going back. Same idea. Two times around, 10 reps. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, awesome. Same thing with the left. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now we're going to do both arms going forward same idea. 10 times, but twice around. Got to warm up our whole body. Boxing is a full body workout. Go at your own pace. Make sure you're breathing. You can take a break when you need it. All right, now we're going to do both arms backwards. Stay loose in between. There's one, two, three, four. Don't put too much speed on it if you're just starting out. You want to feel your body's limits. It's more about the stretch. Good. Okay. Next up is going to be hugs. So we're hugging around and then spreading our arms wide. I alternate which one is on top. And again, two reps is one. We're going to do this 10 times. Stretching out our chest, stretching out our back. Giving ourselves a little love. There's one, two, three, four, five. Again, you can go at your own pace. Nine, 10. Good, shake it out. Okay, next up, you're gonna do both elbows back and then you're gonna reach back. This is a really good for your shoulders. You can do this as a conditioning drill. We're gonna do this as a warm up though. So elbows back, arms back is one rep. We're gonna do that 10 times. 
Get ready. Go. Again, don't have to go my pace. Make sure you're getting that stretch. If you only want to work the shoulders, you can do 20 or 30 of those. All right, next one, you're going to have your feet slightly wider than shoulder width apart, facing forward. And you're going to be reaching across with an elbow and then reaching across with your hand. So elbow and then a reach. And that's one. We're going to do 10 on each side. This is one of my favorites. It's good at cracking my back. Makes me feel great. Let's give it a shot. Keep your feet planted. There's one, two. So it's elbow, reach, elbow, reach, elbow, reach. Good. Feel that stretch. Ten times. Same thing on the other side. So left side this time. Elbow, reach, elbow, reach. Good. Almost there. All right, let's give the lower body some love. We're gonna start with hip circles. So again, feet a little wider than shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent, as wide of circles as you can make with your hips. We're gonna start going uh, in the right direction first, 10 times, big circles. Keep that breathing up. We'll be using our hips a lot in defensive work, punches. So we want to warm up. Now we're going to do the other direction. Same idea. Nice wide circles with the hips. you're breathing 10 times around all right next one is the same sort of thing but we're rotating the upper body instead I call these fatalities that's kind of what you look like you're about ready to take a fatality when you're doing this make sure you don't get dizzy make sure you take it slow but these ones also feel amazing it's one of my favorites Nice big circles, but we're moving the upper body around. We're gonna do that 10 times, but stop if you start to feel dizzy at all. Nice big breaths in your abdomen. Good. Then you're gonna start going the other direction, but you can take a break in between if you need it. Again, do this at your own pace. Really get that stretch. Couple more. There we go. Awesome. Make sure you're staying loose. All right, next one is going to be alternating toe touches. So you take your feet wide, feet pointed straight. You bend over and you're alternating touching each toe. So you touch each and then that's one. And we're going to do this 10 times. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I like those ones the least, so I usually try to do them twice because it means my body needs it. A little more love for the lower body. Get up, get moving. You can do this in between each of the reps too. Just try to start to get that rhythm, start to loosen up. But next up, we're going to be doing high knees. So you can walk these out and really get that stretch. You can also hop them out in order to get uh, that heart rate really going. But we're going to do 10 reps, uh, but each knee you do once for one rep. So let's get 10 of those going. Again, it's okay to just walk these, feel that stretch. We want to get our heart rate up, but we also really want to stretch and warm up our body. Good. All right, next is butt kicks. Again, 
we can do these just walking, uh, but we can also do it in more of a running pace. We're going to do 20 of these. These ones are a little faster. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Good. Awesome job. All right, we're about done here. We're gonna be doing the pivot drill next. Feet a little wider than shoulder width apart. Hands up, we're gonna be punching across the body, hands loose into the end. And only one foot is gonna pivot at a time. So if we're punching with the right, the right foot pivots, sets down before we do the left. We're gonna do this 10 times. Here we go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we are done. Great job, guys. If you need to keep warming up, go for it. But otherwise, head over to one of the workouts on this channel and you can start rolling with those punches. Make sure you subscribe for more boxing content, mental health content. I hope to see you guys next time.